The Marcardial Performance Index, also known as the TIE Index, is made up of a combination of systolic and diastolic values. In patients with idiopathic pulmonary hypertension, the index correlates with symptoms and values above 0.88 predict poor survival. Two different views are needed to determine the Marcardial Performance Index using pulsed wave Doppler. Firstly, the apical four-chamber view is used to visualise the tricuspid valve and so the tricuspid inflow pattern. This shows the placement of the pulse wave Doppler cursor, which has to be parallel to the right ventricular inflow. In this view, the tricuspid valve closure to opening time, or TVC to O, is calculated as the time from the end of the trans-tricuspid A wave to the beginning of the trans-tricuspid E wave. The second view needed is the parasternal short axis view of the right ventricular outflow tract. In this view, we can obtain right ventricular outflow by using pulsed wave Doppler with the sample volume positioned at the centre of the pulmonary artery, ideally at the annulus. In this parasternal short axis view of the right ventricular outflow tract, the ejection time, or ET, is measured from the onset to the cessation of the flow as shown. Myocardial performance index is calculated by subtracting the ejection time, or ET, from the tricuspid valve closure to opening time, or TVC to O, and dividing the result by the ejection time. Myocardial performance index should be corrected if the heart rate exceeds 100 or drops below 70 beats per minute. In order to index to heart rate, the measurement should be multiplied by 75 divided by the heart rate.